but it's like that Spike Lee movie. She's got to have it. Uh-huh. And, and, and I believe there's somebody today, you, you caught up. Yeah. And you got caught up. But guess what? You don't have to stay caught up. That's right. Yeah. Because I, I, I need for somebody who has taken a shortcut. Mm-hmm. Somebody who has gone through the light too fast of life. I need for you to understand that, yes, you may have gotten caught up, and yes, you may be caught up right now. But there is a Savior who loves you and cares for you. And guess what? He shed his blood for you on Calvary's cross. It's so easy to get caught up. We get caught up because we want a shortcut. And we want... We want it, and there's nothing wrong sometimes with the things that we want. But can I help you? It's, 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 like, it's like when we were children and our parents, they understood that there were seasons yeah. when we could do certain things. Yes. They would give us certain things. They would not let us do yeah. certain things before the time. Mm. Like, like, like little girls, they could not be four years old and have nails. And go to the salon. They, they just couldn't do it. No, I'm not knocking it. They just couldn't do it because one, it costs too much. That's a lot. But I know you can buy them now. But two, it's not time. Right, right, right. And I believe that God postponed giving them the child because you guys know, like I know, that sometimes if God allows or we get things too soon, yeah. we can get out of control. What I, what, I, what I loved and I learned is that there are seasons and that there are episodes. And honestly, Sister Smith, I had to ask God, God, I'm ready for you to tell me my episode and my season. Mm. Are you ready for that today? Say, God, you know what? I know what I'm doing, but I need for you. I need for you to get to me. I need for you, God, to tell me. Remember I told you, most of those soap operas, their seasons have ended. Yeah. And can I help you, somebody, Brother Bernie? There are some of you, you are overextending your seasons Mm. with people, with jobs, with churches, with things. You're you're overextending it. It's over. Can y'all say it's over? Mm. It's over. But you are still trying to hold on to it for dear life. Remember, remember, you guys probably remember, Brother Mitchell, remember when we had eight tracks in our cars? You, you, you could push it. I know y'all got digital stuff now, and, but I still have a cassette player in my other car, and I, I just, I just love these cassettes. You could fast forward and rewind it, but I believe that some of us our tape has unraveled on the inside. And, and, and you know how some of us, we, you really need to discard. Oh, God. But so, you, know, you know what I would do? I would get a little piece of yeah. scotch tape. Some of us are, some of us, Sister Smith, we are, the tape has already broken. Yeah. But some of us, like I did, there were some tapes some cassettes, and I love some eight tracks, and I would just take a little piece of tape, just tear it on the ends, and I would take some scissors and carefully cut the ends. And some of us, we're trying to splice together stuff that God says, what are you doing? And you know what the thing about it? When you splice stuff together, (laughs) you'll get a break in the tape. And then eventually, Sister Mitchell, eventually, it breaks again. are looking for other places in the tape to cut and paste together. I've done it. God said, you know what? It's time to discard that. God is saying right now, you, 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 you need to let that go. Mm. So if you're here today, stand to your feet. You're always here. If you're here today,